Hey, Kane crew, it is Sunday, which should be football day, but it is actually the Sunday after Christmas. This is my last Vlogmas video. I'm sorry it took so long, but I kind of was just basking in the moment um, the whole weekend, which is why my house looks like this. But don't worry, we're going to get to that. Before we get to that, I'm just going to run through a couple of um, Christmas events that we partook in over the weekend. And then I'll meet you guys back here for an awesome, deep clean and some undecorated. I'm not quite ready to get rid of this beautiful tree. Just give me a moment. I don't think I'm going to take that down today. We might. Let's be chilling and having a good, good time. Doesn't matter if the snow is falling. So y'all know how I am about my festive clothing and outfits while well, I'm the same way with my kids like these pajamas are everything guys and they had multiple pairs this year so I thought I would share with you guys I got this team Santa pair from um carters and then i was so excited to see these black santa pajamas but they only had them in dash size at old navy i thought old navy really did their thing with the black santa this year and was so excited to snag a pair and then right here it's kind of a mix. I believe Denim's came from TJ Maxx and Dash's came from Target and Dax's came from Old Navy. But how cute are they in all of their festive gear? I had to share that with you guys. This is from Christmas Eve Eve when we had movie night. So that's where this starts off and then we're going to move on to Christmas Eve. <gasps> it says it's Christmas Eve. Would you like an elf breakfast? Me, I do. Huh? Right here. Huh? You said what? Would you like an oat breakfast? Mm -hmm. Huh? <laughs> an elf breakfast. Okay, we'll make it. I see that. You see that one over there? Look. Uh huh. <sighs> They're going to do some magic. We have to add some water and see what happens. Okay. We'll wait for denim though, okay? Good morning, little girl. Happy Christmas Eve. <laughs> yeah, the add water trick. You want breakfast? Mm -hmm. Looks like the elves have set up breakfast. It's Christmas Eve. Elf he breakfast. So while the kids were eating breakfast, I thought I'd run upstairs and do a quick tree tour of Denim's tree, Dash tree, and I'm going to do the main level tree as well. But while I was gone, the kids had did the magic trick without me, so I didn't get to record it. But if you want to see how it worked, the elves have done it before. So you can watch Vlogmas Day 11 where I talk about our elf journey and we shared that portion of that trick being done. But here is the tree tour starting with this beauty, Denim's tree. So first tree we're going to go over some statement pieces with is Denim's tree. So we'll just start with this beautiful mermaid in the middle. She's actually from Hobby Lobby and it's not an ornament. It's roped into there. Um, and then let's just move on to this beautiful ribbon. This one is from um, Hobby Lobby and the gold is from Neiman Marcus. Um, these little mermaids here, they are from uh, Hobby Lobby as well. This Thing. this jellyfish is from Hobby Lobby um, this little lobster here he is from Macy's this is from at home this is from Hobby Lobby um, the bubble looking I don't know if you can see it yet the bubble looking ornaments are from Michaels and what other statement pieces this is from at home the sandcastle is from Kohl's. Actually, I'm sorry. That turtle and the sandcastle, both of them came from Kohl's. Um, this little uh, seashell here is from Macy's. Most of my bulbs, just the standard bulbs, are from like at home, Hobby Lobby, or um, Michael's. And then this little fish, he is from Macy's as well. Um, this little stingray is from 
Macy's as well. So those are just some of the statement ones on Denim Tree that really, really stand out. Oh, I didn't get him. He's from Pottery Bond and his leg broke. We have the other leg. I'll glue it on at the end of the holiday when I take him down. Oh, and these beautiful stick-ins up here. These are from a holiday bazaar that my mom and I went to. So that pretty much concludes the things on Denim Tree. Moving on. Okay, so this is Dash Tree and what's left of what's on it. <laughs> because him and Dax have had the time of their lives with this as you see things on the floor. So like these little, I'll start with these, the little plushy ones are from Amazon. They came in a whole pack from Amazon. Um, and then you have their little dinosaurs. These are from Kohl's. Um, his D is from Michael's and it was painted, so it's kind of like custom. Um, his ribbon came from Hobby Lobby. This came from Kirkland's. I'm not sure where my mom got this one from, guys. So cute. She got this one. Um, so I'm not sure where that one came from. But like his other ornaments, this came from Kirkland's as well. Um, these are like little dinosaur toys ordered off of Amazon. And then his bulbs, standard bulbs, came from either Hobby Lobby or at home. The boxes here, I actually picked these up at um where did i pick these up from home goods home goods they came in a pack of two so the two dinosaur boxes here and then this is just a standard red box that came in like a pack of boxes that i believe we already had and then like these little guys here they came from the home section and at home at, at home it's three of them but yeah, for the most part, the tree held up pretty good. They took a couple of toys out because boys are going to be boys. And this is why we have trees in their rooms because then they can get all that they need out of touching this tree and don't have to touch the main tree. So that's it for Dash's tree. Moving so on. as I am editing, I'm re-recording this because I'm confused where the video went. But I want you guys to kind of get a close up and personal of how this tree was built. So let's just start at the top. These black stickins here that looks like a berries or something or like trees. These here. Those came from Kirkland's along with these black ones. So both black came from Kirkland's. The lime green, these here, squigglies came from a holiday bazaar along with the green leafy looking green as well. The ribbon is from Hobby Lobby. These came from Kirkland as well. I'm not sure where my mom got this engagement ring from, but I love it. Um, she's had it prior, so I just put it on my tree. This buddy here came from Hobby Lobby, I believe. These shoes came from Kirkland's as well. I'm just going over statement pieces for the most part, guys. Um, because most of my bulbs and stuff they come from like Hobby Lobby, Home Goods, and um at home. So these here came from TJ Maxx. This came from the Holiday Bazaar as well. These stickins came from Kirkland's. Um, all ribbon came from Hobby Lobby. These came from Home Goods as well. These um, Starburst came from Car Z Gallery. These came from Z Gallery. Um, these came from Big Lots. Kirkland's again. Um, what else is on here? Our little Grinch guy came from our Grinch's Grotto Experience. I went on and added that one to the tree. Um, these cute glittery balls came from at home, came from these little deer, came from Big Lots, um, Kirkland's. Where are my green stick in? See, that's how you know. I think the kids, oh no, they're right. Here's one. It's another two on the tree. These cute stick -ins came from a holiday bazaar as well. Um, this deco mesh ribbon came from the holiday bazaar as well. Um, what else, guys? These stickins here came from, uh, I believe I got these from Hobby Lobby. Actually, I think my mom, I don't know where my mom picked those up from. Um, what else, guys? I think that's about it. That's for the most part statement pieces. If there's anything on here that you see that you, there's the other green one was right in my face. 
that you want me to go over anything else you see just let me know um as, as far as the tree in itself this tree came from michael's and i actually caught it on sale so seven and a half flock tree from michael's and that's it for the tree as the sky fell tonight we end up putting on our pjs and having one awesome photo shoot guys i'm not even going to talk through it just bask in the moment of all this black family love that i am sharing here these photos came out so good so adorable and i really do love them <laughs> So, of course, no Christmas Eve is complete without cookies for Santa. How cute are our Taylor Gang cookies made by a special friend? Shout out to Rakia, who gifted us these amazing cookies. This is what the kids did to them for Santa. Per the usual, cookie baking is the last activity before we all go down and wait for Santa. So at about 7 o'clock-ish, Santa made his landing and about 7.30, Denim was ready to let it rip. However, she got sent back to bed because Dash wasn't up yet and I didn't want her to start without him. Santa Claus came? Do you think he came? Yeah. Huh? Mm -hmm. Do you? Okay, let's see. Merry Christmas and a happy new year. <laughs> huh? Yeah. What's that, Dashie? The Riddler! Is that Superman so you can play with them? And so the day went with the kids opening and playing with their toys and playing with each other and destroying the living room as it was. But I'm not even mad. I honestly am just basking and living in this moment because the fact of the matter is one day they're going to grow up and your living room is not going to look like this. It's going to be spotless. It's going to be quiet because they've gone on to either their own families or they just won't care about toys and, and care about waking up and the magic that comes with this whole experience. Um, So I'm just living in this moment and, and grateful and looking back at it, I just soak it up even more so that when they are older i won't feel so lonely um because i know that's where it's going um and i'm just again grateful that i'm even able to provide these things and provide this feeling for them um just as it was provided for me i'm just grateful to god that i'm able to do that um here in my household The new and improved John Legend. Sing your song, Jaxie. Good day. Uh huh. What else is this? Good day. Thank you, Dad. High five. We got some bellies. Oh, what did you get, Dana? Airpods. Airpods. Oh, you're fancy. Gross. What do you got? What you get? What's that? Hot Wheels, and then look, you got a Hot Wheels car, the car case. This one. This is his. All of the straight papers. Well, where's Dexter? You got AirPods. It's pretty expensive. I hope you don't lose. 
We got some quiche on the menu. Crab cakes. Salmon. Mac and cheese, baby. We got salad. And chicken. Rice. Stream beans. Yes, God. So, Dax didn't get to go with us that night to my mom's house because he was already asleep for the night. So, I took him back the next day so he could visit with my mom, which he calls BB, and get his gifts. He was kind of excited about this little tablet. And as you see, Denim is ripping open his stuff like it's hers. <laughs> And here we are. It is the Sunday after Christmas and time to get this living room back together, guys. <laughs> here we go.
going to get burnt out or overwhelmed this will do for the day i have to go be mom now so yeah i'm done with this area all right i have all the trash i'm actually going to walk it around to our big dumpster um but i'm going to end the vlog here thank you guys so much for tuning in thanks for supporting me throughout the whole vlogmas process it has been just that a process but it has definitely been fun um it pushed me it challenged me to uh be consistent and it just really opened my eyes to what the possibilities of what can happen here on YouTube. Um, again, I thank you all for your support. And make sure that you are following me on Instagram because then you can see me every single day. Also, um, make sure that you are subscribed, like and share. And if you miss me, go ahead and binge the vlogmas special it'll all make you feel absolutely special um in every which in every formal way because you are special and um that's it i guess i have one more video coming this week in the year 2020 and then we are moving on to 2021 so i'll see you guys in the next one Peace. okay you guys enter nalesti who is the winner All right, at Charming Journey, you are the winner of the Kane Christmas giveaway. Please DM me so that we can work out the details of you getting your vacuum cleaner or stain mop. Congratulations.